Ladies and gentle ladies, I wanted to talk to you guys about what it means for the new mechanic that Genshin Impact has introduced to the game since Genshin Impact 5.0 or since the release of the Natlan region. But the reason why I'm talking about this is because after using Moalani, I'm just very very in a state of wondering what's gonna happen next with the new characters. Obviously, the you know newest potential character or the actual just newest character is going to be uh Kinnich. and i'm very very excited for that character and i cannot wait for his release and he just has such a unique mechanic alongside uh, moalani just that they have the surfboard thing with moalani as well as the grappling thing with Kinnich. they are just very very cool now what this mechanic is specifically called is like night soul blessing since the release of this new mechanic i've been just hey what if this is a mechanic that they legitimately have limitless possibilities on what they can do with it? they have so so many options on what they can possibly do with it for example create a character that has a night soul ability that teleports from one place to another across the map or something like that i mean i'm not talking about waypoints i'm talking about like this just like looking at the other spot and then TPing to it. Something like coaching, but much, much farther. I don't know, something like that, right? Or maybe something like a full-on car or, or, or a bike or something like that. I don't know. Some cool stuff that we could potentially see. It just has limitless possibilities. We've already seen one with Kachina where she's able to climb walls faster. We've seen Mualani. She's able to traverse the land faster and on top of water too and we've seen a kinich which has the grappling hook stuff now they could potentially make a character that is a very formidable in you know underwater and they could swim really quick faster than nuvlet can and i feel like that's a very very interesting prospect and um idea that genshin impact can very easily implement thanks to this new system this new system means that you can do a lot of stuff, like limitless amount of stuff, more than what I mentioned, much, much more. And it just has so much potential that I just cannot wait to see what kind of characters that are going to be coming. I'm talking about Mavuika, which is going to be an Archon that is probably going to have a Night Soul Blessing as well, which will make her pretty awesome. Now, I'm just imagining Mavuika having having one of these the uh, energy bars on the bottom and her skill or something like that gets increased amount of damage the more it depletes or something like that i don't know but it could be something very very crazy and i cannot wait to see what it is and these characters have infinite potential thanks to that now let's just go straight to moalani and talk about how much it is invested into her kit or integrated into her kit that you just can't avoid it right for example straight up the first passive or the a1 passive whatever it's called instantly integrated here you can see that you can generate some puffers within her kit to instantly restore the nitro point and then on her a2 passive you can see that the that the night soul blessing is already into play here as well when you trigger a night soul burst while on gains one stack of wave chasers exploit which lasts for a few seconds with a maximum of three stacks and then this increases her damage with the boom shaka laka or uh, shark luck i should say and then you also have some more passive talents this is basically what her night soul blessing is which is just pretty cool right it's just so integrated within her kit and allows you to do more damage and allows you to do so much more stuff with it that this has so much more effect than i think numa and Ouija ever had and i definitely think that the new characters that would potentially use these abilities are going to have an absolute field day with this and I just cannot wait to see what Genshin Impact can introduce with this. We're already going to see some Kinnish actions very, very soon, which I'm very, very excited about. I said very a lot of times there. 
and yeah i'm just wondering what would happen in the future let me know what you guys think as well are you guys excited for a potential crazy character that maybe can fly better than the wanderer or something of that sort i don't know all i can say is that they're going to introduce some cool cool mechanics with these especially for four star characters genshin impact love 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 to do some experiments some weird stuff with four star characters so we should also look out for those in the up and coming future hey maybe even a character like xylonen would have a night soul blessing that buffs other characters just something straight out of my brain right there boom imagine that that'd be pretty sick and yeah that's pretty much it that's all i wanted to talk about just a little bit of a rant type situation and let me know what you guys think in the comments i'll see you guys in the next video very soon goodbye